everyone, MSX back here, and I, here at above Chemical Plant, where the missions are, and I'm actually going to be doing this mission, and I don't know, and if you know, because my lack of enthusiasm for these missions, you might be wondering why. Oh, is this little monitor signifies, is, or, I, I know for at least this mission I saw, and yep, as you can read, the Aqua Shield. And doing this, we will be able to tame the Aqua Shield skill. And the Aqua Shield on my Sonic 3 Knuckles is nice and broken. So I actually, so I'm gonna do a little detour and see. I'm gonna get this shield. I'm not sure when I get the Fire Electric, but I wonder at Well, I'll get this one for now. And well, like in the classic, just double jump. Yeah, we can actually get some nice air in this game with the bubble shield. Not sure if it makes you immune to those, but not in the experimenting mood right now. Yeah, get up there. So yeah. I don't know if the other elemental shields are going to correspond to a particular stage, like maybe the fire shield will be available in modern stage, Crisis City, or if it will... Whoa, got a little bit of lag slow down. Or if it will... Um... Oh jeez. Somehow I knew that was going to not go that well. Can't say I didn't say it. Come on. This is where I wish I had Sonic 4 physics back. Interesting to note there is a skill that will will give you Sonic 4 physics. Sorry for a platforming failure. Finally. Oh jeez. I'm taking the hit. Has to be a bubble shield down here. Indeed, there is. So now it's time for a little bit of a platforming trial. At least I know these missions aren't that hard. Sorry about that. No one gives two shits if I record or not. E. A little bit of floaty physics in the air. Whoa! Spike ball. Yeah, these missions, or at least this one, isn't all that hard. Look, we're right at the end. And just by doing this mission, we can get a nice little, uh, shield. You know, looking into this now, I'm going to look to see if Fire or Electric will be in Green Hill or Sky Sanctuary. I would assume since they only appear, appeared, appeared in Classic Era. So yeah. Before I do so, I want to bring this little bonus spell. That song, Toxic Caves. Now let me just take a quick little peek. Knuckles race I oh so hate. Oh. Better be that last gate. Indeed it is. So if I am right, then this one should have the fire shield. Nope. Power sneakers for now. No. I guess not all the monitors are gonna have it. Let me just take a quick peek at Sky Sanctuary. Well, that was some nice physics right there. Sky Doppelganger Race. Go for that.
Whoa, almost missed it. I guess not. Well, if there is, I'll come back for it. But I think I put this off long enough. Time to move up in console generations. Yes, we know to spam the square button that actually works. I forgot if I mentioned that. And thus, time for a speed highway. <sighs> Monkeys. A nice techno remix. I don't care if you're not a techno fan, I like it. You should too, just because it's Sonic. Ugh, and because it's Sonic, we got platforming. Whoa! E? E car! I would assume they actually run you over. Since most drivers do not have any consideration for the road. Whoa! Looks like I don't have any consideration for spikes. Sonic somehow has a driver's license? I don't think so. This hotel might be familiar. Sonic Adventure, you only are in it for a split second. Now we actually have to scale it. Oh joy. <laughs> Kill you before you go off. E. Jeez, I wonder... <laughs> So you can press circle a duck, or you can just press down. This makes me wonder how, how, what do people have to go through to get their cars? Ooh, don't mind if I do. Uh, Whoa, platforming fail. Let's try this again, please, with less fail. Can't okay, wait for you to come back. Whoa! This game needs to be freezing up. From what I've noticed, the PS3 seems to be the worst of the ports. I mean, that modern music doesn't start, there are glitches. I'm pretty sure some of them will probably be present in the other version, but I haven't seen. When Yoshiller was here to record his let's play or walk through for the PC version. It supported 360 and it didn't seem to have that many problems. <laughs> redundancy. Oh, wait, that wasn't redundancy. That's just me being clever. Eee. That part does not automatically launch you. Staying true to the original Sonic Adventure game, whoop de doo Sega decides this level needed less automation. So just wait till we get to modern. That was not that bad. Die. Monkey, how the- I just went to the one and fail. And that was the end of the level. What's with the freezing? Could just be my PS3. Hope it isn't. Well, we restored Parsh a speed highway.
Now it's time to blaze three for the second half. Notice on the, uh, by the entrance that brown side to the left says E123 Omega Road. Ooh, we get Angel Island music. Oh. Time to move on. Okay, I probably not try to sing. I'll just ruin it. So let's let the game do the singing. And yes, because we move into the era with the light speed dash, we get my speed dash tutorial and the ability. What I don't get is stomping came in modern. Why do we have it back in Genesis? I I don't know how Sega what what brain Sega decided to put in charge of the pow of abilities, but definitely not the smartest of the bunch. Anyway, speed highway time. Oh yeah. Up, oh, fail. Fail! Because, because as you know, this whole this stage, of course, they decided to hold true to the original game also. So it was a little automation, lack of invisible walls, and anything else you expect from Sonic Adventure. Sonic Adventure lack of invisible walls? I do not remember. Yeah. Something I wish Sega didn't go true to. Oh yeah, I mean I was talking about glitches and that stuff before, that reminded me. Press triangle for light speed dash. One. How is that not a health hazard? How do people in the hotel not report that? Anyways. Um dang, I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh yeah, when doing the tricks, I see like the 360 or PS or Steam. People can do tricks a lot faster with on the PS3. You have to. Don't make it. The light speed dash went backwards. Learn to program, Sega. Anyways, on the PS3, I noticed that you always have to wait till Sonic finishes his animation. When the 360 or Steam, you can just do it almost instantaneous. I don't know if it's just be me. And we are going down. Now, I think this stage is memorable and why Phantom wanted to be back was because of the at dawn set. Uh, of course though, that's the only section they don't bring back from this stage. Yep, it's back to what it was before. Lack of automation and no beautiful city skip. Oh my god! How did I not die? I will not question it. And of course, to add more salt to the moon, it's actually sunrise. Not dawn. Oh come on, the cars hurt you. I wanted to dis I wanted to run into the car and see it flying like in the SA2. I remember this part, we're almost at the end. Come on, how did I miss the red ring? You see how well, you can't see because you can't see the controller, but I was moving the uh, analog stick, but it, it he just wasn't doing the tricks. I don't know what it is with this um, stage, or, you know, with this version. This doesn't seem, this doesn't seem good. Of course, they port the better version, but why couldn't they just fix this one too? And Sonic tries to promote happiness to along little kids. Eh. 
And we get a trophy for destroying speed highway, which translates into an achievement, quite literally, on Steam and uh, Steam 360. Have to wait till next time to do the challenges. However, next time we move on to probably the most iconic of the 3D stages. So until then, see you guys later.